Hey y'all, happy October 5th. Long time no vlog. I haven't vlogged in so long. But today we're doing something really fun, so I thought I'd pick up my camera and vlog. Um, we are gonna go to the Lights Festival, and just a disclaimer, this vlog is not sponsored, but they did give me free tickets for this event. But I thought, why not vlog it? Because it's vlog content. <laughs> So I'm really excited about it. I'm sorry about this lighting. It's kind of crazy. We're literally out in the middle of nowhere um, The location is Austin, Texas, but uh, It's like an hour away from Austin. Obviously you can't do you know a big lantern festival in the middle of the city So it kind of has to be a little farther out um, it's, it's just like safety regulations and all that stuff. It was about an hour away from our place we are three minutes away. Oh. Turn left onto County Road 428. We're three minutes away from the event, and I tried to research because I'm just that kind of girl that likes to plan. I like to know what I'm getting myself into, so I actually am wearing this romper, and I'm wearing like sneakers too because I read somewhere that you kind of have to walk a lot. Um, and then we brought some blankets and like a blow up little like bean bag situation. I brought all my camera gear. I'm so excited to take pictures because I got a new lens. We're gonna be there in two minutes, so I'll show you all around. We are walking into the event space. I have like this hat. I think I got this from like Nasty Gal. It's actually really cute. Thought it would be the perfect day to wear it. Look at these hay bales. Is that hay bales? Hay bales? Bale. Bale. Hey Bales, <laughs> we just got our lanterns. They're all in my hands. I have so much stuff in my hands though. I can barely hold this dang camera. So I'm just gonna update y'all later. So I actually just stopped for a photo op near the hay bales because I couldn't pass it up and they turned out really cute. So I'll insert it here, but these people are super smart. They're sitting in the shade, but as you can tell, the stage is all the way over there. So we're gonna make our way near the stage. On your ACL right now? I, I literally feel like I'm at ACL right now, but like not <laughs> at all. Uh, this is like our ACL, it's fine, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's gonna be so cool though, seeing all the lanterns. It's definitely gonna get way cooler at night. And we are actually sitting in the shade. We found a shady spot like kind of near the stage. So we opted for this shady spot because I was not about to bake in the sun, but but this guy is like trying to hype everyone up. He's like asking questions. He's like, who's on their first date? Is this anyone's anniversary? And it's like weird to think that me and Ryan have been dating for almost seven years in January. Like I was like, how many dates have we even been on? Like that's crazy. We have the nicest okay, don't me. Sometimes whenever I'm in like grassy areas, I get really itchy. So I bought bug spray just as a placebo effect. <laughs> I don't know if bugs are actually biting me. I think it's just like the grass just like, I don't know, making me itchy, but we brought a blanket. We're sitting on the blanket, so it should be good. I really wanted it to be so cold and like... If you're in Georgia right now, if you looked out here, it'd be like 60. Yeah. It's probably like 90 something, but guys, Austin is dropping to the 70s in, it's 94 right now. But anyways, Austin is dropping to the 70s next week. I could not be more excited. I already told Ryan we should go on a hike. Like, we have not even done, like, the 360 lookout. We haven't done Mount Fawnell. We need to, like, hike more and do more outdoorsy things. Because Austin's just, like, super outdoorsy city. Um, but we have just not gotten around to it just because it's so freaking hot outside. So, I'm excited for it to start getting colder. There's a hashtag. It's hashtag. They have a lot of good food to choose from. I see funnel cakes over there, so I'm definitely getting that later. Um, but they have street tacos, smoothies, milkshakes, cotton candy. I've been seeing a lot of people um, get that, and it's like literally bigger than their face, so it's pretty cool. So we are walking closer to the stage right now. And to the right of the stage, they have these little blow up bags, and we actually brought our own but I didn't know they would have these, so we're gonna go check it out because this looks really cool. All right, I'm chewing on an ice cube. It is freaking hot out here, but we actually came right up to the stage because I noticed it was shady here too. So we got our set up all over here. We got milkshake things. He got cake batter and I got 
pina colada and I've always seen these things in QT in Georgia. The, what's it called? Real? Real? <laughs> I've never had it before in my life and they are so good. This literally is a pina colada in this little cup. It's so good. And I've been actually craving a pina colada recently so this hits the spot. We got hot dogs from this truck right here. <laughs> Ryan is the ultimate Instagram husband of the evening. Got my camera bag, backwards hat. <laughs> We're sweating out here. There's music. This is our own ACL. You know it. <laughs> Ryan's funny one is gonna be. My, mine's low key real though. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god! Ryan! You better freaking scratch that out! I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> I hope we all want to line them at the same time, and it's going to be worth it. It's going to be beautiful. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. 